Good morning, guys. So, with most of the kids in school, I figured that I would hop on here. I have Coco Melon on for the babies, hoping that holds them over so that I can make the video. But, um, I just wanted to get on and really go a little more into detail about our house from the first video I did. And, um,. We've lived here, it's going on, it's no! two years. officially two years. No! Okay, sir. Liam wants to join us. But it has been officially two years since we have lived here now. And I also wanted to go into detail about um, my fiance, my kids, their age. Well, not his age, but my kids' age. And how long me and him have been together. Me and him have been together for four years now. And we've been engaged for almost a year. And we are looking to set a wedding date about the next one to two years down the line. There's no nothing set in stone as of yet. We have to actually sit down and get all those details done. And then for... Um, the kids. Freya is five months now. He is a year and a half. They are actually 11 months apart by two weeks. Her birthday is August 7th. His is August 21st. He's August 21st, 2020. She's August 7th, 2021. So they are 11 months apart only by two weeks. And then um, Jordan is three well three and a half he'll be four in may the girls you already know are a year and a day apart selena is jan is not january april 18th and rosalind is april 19th and they will be five and six in april and um johnny just turned seven his birthday was january 19th we had his birthday party this weekend and um I did get some pictures in that, but I don't know how to upload them because I'm on my Chromebook. So if I figure that out, I will put it in with this video. If not, I'm just going to upload the video as is. And that's the gist of it. Other things to talk about. I am still working on myself, my self journey. I journal every single day. I do my spiritual practices and readings every single day because I am an eclectic witch. I don't think I've ever went into detail about that, but that is my spiritual path and journey that I've been taking. And it's been working amazingly for me and my kids and my family. I heard the baby start crying, but I think it's just the TV. <laughs> but, um, I am looking into because I'm also an entrepreneur. My job back at the apartment fell through and I no longer work that so I am unemployed at the time. But I'm going to start making tumblers. I also make jewelry like uh, this bracelet or um, I'm even working on like rings. Like that's what I have on right now as my engagement ring. We made it together. And that's, I'm trying to get my own personal business up and going and I am praying that it just flourishes and takes off so that I can have an income in that sense to help out with the house and maybe we can upgrade one day and get a bigger house because we have such a big family. My stepdaughter, her name is Kylie. She is 11. Her birthday's in July. You probably will never really see her at all or very seldom in any of the vlogs. But um, we get her on weekends and then every other week during the summer we're shooting for two weeks in the summer. So we'd get her for two weeks every other week. And um, that would be great. But um... I want to save up for, well that's what I'm doing right now, I'm saving up for an actual vlogging camera. So like if I want to sit down and do a video like this on my laptop, I can. 
but I'd love to have an actual vlogging camera so I can upload it to my computer and do way longer videos. Like I got to do four years ago and then my camera broke so I was stuck on my phone yet again. So a lot of my vlogs will be based off of my phone still until I get a camera or they will be on the Chromebook like this if I have time to actually sit down and talk. But I wanted to just give you guys a little more in-depth because when I just did the walkthrough of the house, I did not at all tell you exactly how old the kids were or um, just really go in-depth of anything of like how long we've lived at the house, how long I've been with my fiance, which his name is Will, or um, how long we've been engaged, stuff like that. And I just really felt myself personally that that needed to be out there in its own separate video. And with the kids finally being in school, because sadly, right after Christmas and after, we all got COVID, the whole household got hit with it. So we had just gotten out of quarantine and the kids finally got to go back to school. And it was the weekend of Martin Luther King and that, it was that Monday that they got to, so they went to school two weeks last week, then they had an extended weekend. And Martin Luther King Jr. Day, we got hit with all that snow, so we didn't have school, they didn't have school Tuesday or Wednesday. So they had two days last week, and then they're back this week. And we're supposed to be getting more snow. We got some yesterday, but it was earlier in the day that it was well controlled. So, depending on tonight, because we're supposed to be getting another three inches tonight into tomorrow morning. Praying they get to go to school because they all miss school. They love school. They absolutely need that in-person environment because last year virtual was just horrendous. And so... Getting them back on their school schedules and us getting back into a schedule is just a day at a time. But I'd love to do my morning routines with the kids, getting them ready for school, and when they're finally in school with the younger kids, doing bedtime routines, doing day in the life, so getting segments of what we do throughout the day, and just fun stuff like that. Just so you guys know, you're going to hear Freya cry a lot. She is a super colicky baby, and it's a work in progress. We're doing everything we can. She's becoming more happy, more playful, more alert, but she is very fussy because she has a lot of built-up gas. But she is starting to fuss, and he's getting antsy, pushing buttons, <laughs> and grabbing my mouse. So I think I'm going to end this video here. I'm just really glad I was able to sit down, even for this short amount of time to sit and talk to you guys. I'm just really excited to be getting back into the swing of things, but hopefully we can get two, my goal is two vlogs within the week, or if not, one, do once a week, but my goal is two a week. But I'll, if we do once a week, once a week is fine. I know I've tried before and failed, given we have a good three year gap of no videos, but, new beginnings new starts and just up from here that's all we can think positively is ups from here but all right goodbye you guys you want to say bye bye liam say bye bye say bye bye say bye bye he waved okay bye you guys